Hello, welcome to another video. This limit has no limit. Oh uh, no, that's incorrect. While the limit of this is not negative infinity, and it's not positive infinity, yeah, and it's not zero. In short, the limit does not exist. Remember, it's not negative infinity, it's not positive infinity, it does not exist. Because I know that limits that do not exist have been the most confusing portion of limits because people don't know the difference between positive infinity, negative infinity, and does not exist. So, let me speak to you in English and then we speak math. Speaking in English first, what do you think is going to happen if we start going from small numbers to big numbers? Let's say, um, you know, this is a rational expression and no matter what happens, um, look at the rational expression. Oh, the numerator is bigger than the denominator, so this number is bigger than 1. Okay, so this is 1.5. Now, just watch this. Let's say we're trying to go from, let's start from 0, for example, when this is 0, this is going to be 1 and not 0. And then when it's 1, you're going to get negative 3 over 2. That's the next value. The next value is going to be when you square it, it's going to be, oh, it's going to be positive 9 over 4. And then the next value is going to be this to the third power, but the negative sign is going to be retained. You go back to negative 27 over 8. Do you observe something that the values on our graph... Typically, when something goes to positive infinity, it will keep increasing, okay? It goes to negative infinity, it keeps going this way. But this guy started from 1, okay? And then it went to negative 1.5, somewhere here. And the next one was 2.25. And you see what it's doing? This graph is behaving like this. Okay, 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 but there is no end to it because we don't know what the last thing is going to be because we're going to infinity. So this is what you mean by does not exist because it is either going to positive infinity or it's going to negative infinity or it's going to zero, but we know this is getting bigger as it moves away from zero. As it approaches infinity, it's going to get bigger and bigger, but we're looking for a number that could be both positive and negative. Is there a number like that? No. There is no such number that is both negative and positive. Because we don't know where this is going to end up. Therefore, this limit does not exist. Just looking at it graphically in mathematics. How do you show it does not exist? Okay, this is what you do. The limit as x goes to infinity of negative 3 over 2 raised to power x could be rewritten as the limit as x goes to infinity. We want to bring this guy down because we don't know how to deal with it. So the only way to bring down an exponent from an exponential function is to take the natural log. So we're going to take the natural log of this, okay? But when you take the natural log, you have to undo it. See, so this undoes this so that whatever you write next is still the same thing. So we have negative 3 over 2 raised to power x. Nice. Now we can bring this x down behind here so that becomes the limit as x goes to infinity of e to the x, a natural log of negative 3 over 2. And this is where the problem becomes obvious because the natural log of anything I mean, the argument of natural log cannot be negative because natural log does not exist in the negative region. Remember that the graph of natural log is something that goes this way. It does not even get to zero. So the smallest value you can get is anything just before zero. So you don't even get a chance to plug in negative numbers for natural log. Therefore, there's nothing to plug in here. There's nothing to get here. And therefore, there's nothing to get here no matter what x becomes. So this does not exist. So you say, but 
natural log of negative 3 over 2 does not exist. Therefore, the limit as x goes to infinity of this guy, negative 3 over 2 to the x does not Never stop learning. Those who stop learning have stopped living. Bye-bye.